also were road dogs now. Because not only to give the VIP meal, he was like, hey, before you come in next time, ask for me, which has never happened to me before, which has always been my dream. To the point where I've gone to Starbucks like 10 days in a row ordering the same thing every day with the hopes that I can one day go up to the drive through and being like, it's Ludwig, and they go, all right, let's get him the usual. I don't know why. This has always been a dream of mine, but I want to walk into a place Say, get me the usual, and they get me a usual. And it's never worked. It doesn't happen. That's all I want. It's all I want in life. And I'm I'm close. I think I'm close with this guy. So we go to this hoagie place, and this is this is like how my introduction to Matt and like what a troll he is. But like in such a good way. Like I learned a lot from him. We go into this place, into this hoagie place, and there's like, you know, these these lines and everything. And it's like the first day of school. Or one of the first days of school, at least. And Matt walks in. He's got his he's got his ID in his hand, and he like throws it down on the counter. Like then like slides across the counter towards the uh, the woman at the cash register. And Matt says, "I'll have the usual." <laughs> like obviously, she's <laughs> never seen him before. Like even if she did see him before, then it's like it's the beginning of a of a new semester. Like she wouldn't have seen him all summer. But like he's like, "I'll have the usual," and she's like, "What?" Like so, like, so taken aback by what just happened and I'm next to him absolutely mortified because I was raised to like be polite and everything like to servers they've got a tough job and this guy's just fucking with them and I like, obviously <laughs> haven't learned anything Chad <laughs> yeah, exactly but yeah and like so you did that and like you were like you were like, like upset when they didn't know your order and you're like are you serious oh come on it's a wheat roll I want a wheat roll like, you but know did I not become Good friends with all of them. Yeah, and that was just the thing. That's what. That's why I learned. Because I thought, oh, I should be polite. They have a tough time. They don't want some asshole messing around with them. They do want an asshole messing around with them. He was so just like, it was like delightful to them, almost. And from that point on... I was an asshole everywhere. <laughs> yeah, that and... But he would do that all the time. He'd come in, usual. But it actually worked to the point that, as I said, there's always these huge lines here. It's the only thing open so late. We'd walk in... And Matt would walk, through, he'd be walking through the doors to this place, and Matt would give a head nod to one of the women behind the counter. And she would just make his hoagie. Like, yep. wouldn't even charge him for it. She'd just make the hoagie, put it down for him. It was like, and like, she could have, she like, like slide it to me, Chad. Yeah. Like, she, and like, the rest of us are sitting there in line, like a bunch of chumps. And that's when I realized that you do, like, it is actually good to mess around with people because they'll, honestly, they appreciate it. They're bored. Every single day, a bunch of people come in and make their order and are probably a little disrespectful, but in like a sort of like dismissive way where they're like, I don't even want to talk to you, you know? It's like you see that thing often where they say like, hey, how's your day? And you say like, I would like a hoagie. And they're like, oh, okay, cool. I guess we're not doing this. But you actually really engaged with them. I became Facebook friends with them, chap. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you, yeah. And there was like a small romance subplot with one of them with you, but that, yeah. <laughs> then she got pregnant. Okay, no. That's and moved funny. and moved like halfway down the country. <laughs> no, okay. He didn't get anybody. She pregnant. was the love of my life. He didn't get anybody pregnant. <laughs> no, I didn't get her pregnant. <laughs> Dave did. Okay, none of us got her. I don't even know if she got pregnant. I don't know if that's real. But yeah, we didn't we didn't get her pregnant. But 